Seville on the river Guadalquivir in southern Spain. For 500 years, this was one of the main centers of Moorish Andalusia. The city is a fascinating mix of Christian and Muslim influences. This is the famous Giralda bell tower. And before I get down to dancing, just time for a power siesta. I've come to Sevilla to learn more about the folk dance that carries the name of the city, the Sevillana. It is an upbeat and simple form of flamenco and it is a must for pros to know as well as for flamenco amateurs. I have been dancing flamenco myself for some years and the first thing that I learned was indeed the Sevillana. Now I want to get some tips from Andalusian pros. Vamos, let's go! Juan Paredes is a professional dancer and teacher at the Flamenco Museum. Hola Juan. Maria, buenos días. ¿Qué tal? What do you think of my dress? Very nice. I can see that you really want to dance with us. And your dress is red and black, the colors of flamenco. Let's dance. Yes, let's do it. As I'm not a complete novice, I make a good start. The basic steps aren't so easy. It takes a good few hours to get it right. But Juan isn't happy with my posture. Apparently, I raise my shoulders too much and my arm movements could flow better. A Sevillana has four verses that are each danced differently, but all the parts have the same basic steps, turns, and final position. How do we hold each other? It's of the utmost importance to have contact all the time, because this is a dance of seduction. The man wants to hold the woman like this. And we have to maintain eye contact all the time. Strangely, the bodily contact doesn't seem to bother me so much today. In contrast to other flamenco dances, the footwork is very simple. Traditionally, the Sevillana is danced by a man and a woman or by two women. When do you dance the Sevillana? All the time. Street parties, communion celebrations, weddings, even in discos. Everyone dances it. If you're Spanish. If you like it, you'll learn it quickly. The Sevillana has a standard choreography, but every teacher likes to put their own stamp on it to give their variation a unique flair. Gracias, Juan. Thank you very much. Well, I think I learned a lot more about Sevillana, especially regarding posture. Now it's time for a traditional Andalusian flamenco evening. Around midnight, you will find a lot of singing and dancing going on in many bars in Seville. My friend Raul and I soon get carried away, too. The Sevillana is a wonderful dance which can really get you in a great mood. Although I must admit I'm a little bit biased because I like dancing flamenco a lot. In Spain, the good thing about Sevillana is that many people dance it at parties or in a bar like this one here. For me, this is one dance that could go on forever, and fortunately, nights in Seville can be long.